Through totems, following between heaven and earth, explore the vast and pristine snow plateau. Trace back to the source. Follow the order of all things growing. The vibrant lives gallop on the magnificent land. The veins of civilizations run through thousands of mountains and rivers. The passionate lives tell the story of man and nature. Guolua, where the Yellow River begins, cultivating mystery and also cultivating an ancient and unique civilization. Seeking precious love and faith, accumulating, precipitating, and sublimating over the years. 76,442 square kilometers. In the persistence of faith, the beauty of life blossoms, not only in the fiery splendor. We are always on the move and growing. In retrospect, every step we have taken will be a tribute to the plateau. Маркета нет, а первым чу вели, как делал это у них. Как тебе там дают чу вели, да и рыть. Юнь! Нет, у меня как дяк не делают. Там мы нахуй, ебать чем твоим, как дяк он. Я? Это тебе как зумок, это? Вау, не дяк он зыл. Вели так, что эти моку. Или два сына? Нет. Я не это чу гумер, там да ник. Ten years ago, as a calf was sick, Peng Cheng met the vet, Tashi Dote. Since then, he has been following his master and has set off into veterinary medicine. The Yellow River source, forbidden area for lives. Cattle and sheep follow the natural law of wild growth. Therefore, there is not too much complex diseases. That Pengchen has to deal with, regular warming and vaccination, ensure that most cattle and sheep grow up healthy and strong. But even simple deworming and vaccination take up almost all of Pengcheng's time during the spring and autumn months. The Yellow River source, heavily Mardor. Here, with long distance to cover, this place is vast and boundless. Pengcheng rides a motorbike and maneuvers his way through the desolate mountains. The wind that blows in fills his clothes and capture the short summer of the grassland. For Peng Cheng making a life means being a good vet, protecting the souls and preserving the ecological balance may be Peng Cheng's cure for his heart. Yeah, I can't get it. Get it, 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 get
Ah, t'as un tour, c'est ton Tu es dans le 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 tu es dans Nous Je <coughs> Doigion, Watching the river rise, checking to see if the soil changes, helping to create new life are important parts of Penting's petrol work and measures for the improvement of the ecological conditions. Many people like Peng Chen, rooted in the plateau, guarding the green mountains and rivers, to protect the three rivers' souls with a solid ecological barrier. They bring their simplest and most unwavering strength to bear. In Pengcheng's petrol area, half of the water sources are near hers. In the mid-summer, herders live along the river, singing and laughing. Compared to other petrol areas, this water area is more troublesome for Pengcheng to patrol. The temperature is pleasant in the summer afternoon. Children can always find the simplest and purest joy in this season. In their interactions, they also got to know the patrol captain who kept interrupting their fun. But they seem unafraid. And they know every summer vacation, Pinto always turned to them for help. 
This makes the children tacitly gain some confidence in resisting authority. Zhang Linyang. Zhang Linyang. Jiang Ge. Kakak,我这里也可以。这这这这。哎，你这个铁头车怎么一个车子坐的？铁人一头车坐的。铁人一头车坐的。铁人一头车坐的。铁人一头车坐的。铁人一头车坐的。铁人一头车坐的。铁
Nanjan Township at the foot of Bayan Har Mountain is located in the Daji country. It's remote with an average altitude of over 4,000 meters. The natural environment is harsh, residents are scattered, and transportation is extremely inconvenient. Director Awan Tanda's first daily job is to broadcast the police information he has collected through the village broadcast, broadcasting his advice spread to every corner of the village. Whenever there are people, the police information must reach. <laughs> <笑>我都是没办法 the villagers on duty are always very far, from the paved road at the start to the chatterous mountain roads, and then the muddy dirt roads. No matter how far you go, you never seem to reach the end. Director Awan Danda always says, Once we got over the mountain, we will see it. But when you look up, there are only endless mountain ranges, stretching as far as the eyes can see. <laughs> Life in the pastoral area is simple and free. Various festivals bring the scattered nomadic people together. Everyone sings and dances, sharing their longings for each other. The summer on the grassland passes in an instant. Therefore, this gathering is especially precious. Awan Danda and the police officers actively move among the tents and the people. They see the rare opportunity to educate. <laughs> Deep in the pastoral area, 
information is blocked. Telecom fraud has severely affected the lives of the people. Relying solely on their work is far from enough. More investment is needed and bolder publicity. Protecting the wallets of the herders is also an indispensable part of protecting the souls. Good. 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 The bright red armband is the aspiration of many ordinary people. It bears witness to countless acts of selflessness and unwavering commitment through hardships. 대령 라든 전성나 아기 강신군 살근 갈등 연통 낭식이 잡은데 참이 갑스치. 다들 쇼니 제가 마저 쇠지매 강신군 라든 나질러 논용으로 또그 먼튼도 여기 갈등 연통 그 응간도 커트고 샤워 리고 그쪽나 가 여기 갈등 연통 그 응간데 니나 여기 르친 그 샤워 거드그래 쓰나 여기 녹통 강거 거드그래 인다 먼다 먼튼도 흐레이고 샤워 누고 주고서 거서 어야 참이 갑스치 아. With their youth, they feel the roughness of wind and gravel. They listen to the breath of grass roots and streams. They touch the pounds and the ebb and flow of life. The clearest footprints are left on the muddiest roads. The end of the road is sure to be a bright and a clear sky. Oh, check over. Did you check? 단육 차지 금주가 고금무 어야 상당한 점 수지대 수지 수지 잘 농아질라 어야 지난 거 물고 지난 거 농이지 이런 반장 줄려 우리 이디어 바지가 바지 치니까 치니 견지 우리 단자 줄리 여우 출발 이장 치니 상 동료 이 상지 집에 상지 예수 부주지 지내 치 나가로 마 사실 사유 你不是穷酸的。哦，就这帮忙打不少。哎，干你家伙，帮大爷出工资，我讲破钢工，你这，我去三班破钢工，我讲不要工的，过工。阿拉嫂，阿哥哥。你要搞这个口子？搞这个口味。你莫吃不赢哦。赢赢赢。让咱吃点。没有，我。啊，对啊，对，吃吃吃。让多点。啊，开吃开吃。快点吃。啊，吃点咱同咱同买咱同饮
like Director Awan, the seemingly ordinary and insignificant guardians, give their all in dedication to their passion. They provide warmth and peace to this honest land. The road to the future is not always smooth. What they need to do is to steadfastly follow the direction pointed by the river and chase the light cast by the sun. Never stop him, never pause him. The road they walk under the stars and moon is brightly illuminated by their original aspiration. <laughs>